Hi, my name is Jeff Peach. About 10 years ago, we created our first technology lab based on some ideas we had on integrating technology, multimedia with the curriculum. We asked ourselves questions about how could we get teachers to come and collaborate? How could we make technology really work with the curriculum? What we created was a unique model of teaching and learning with technology. Welcome to the Rattler Pit. When I thought about studying this, what I, what I delighted in finding was something that was working, something that was working very, very well. And I wanted to present that um, and say why it was working well. So when somebody took this dissertation off the shelf, they could say, oh, here's an example of a computer lab that's, that, that's based around a way teachers think when they work, maybe a new way to think about work. And uh, that idea intrigued me very much, and it was, uh, uh, it was something that I could go in and observe. I could, see, uh, I could see Jeff working with teachers. I could see teachers getting excited. I could see them getting comfortable with the technology. I could see them doing things that they would not normally do. And, uh, and so it became a very powerful experience for them. When I first arrived, we had just started the school and we had the Blueberry Lab. And I walked up there as a classroom teacher with absolutely no knowledge of the Apple system whatsoever and walked in and Jeff Peach was the one that got me going because he was the one that had the ideas and he took the things that I was already doing in my curriculum and said, how about if? But we learned and we started adapting. We started bouncing ideas off of each other's heads again. It, again, it's collaboration, man. Yeah, by collaborating, and having that spark in your mind on, I want to include technology, uh, we came up with great ideas and each person would come up with something different. And I try to take, you know, the warlords or whatever we're doing in social studies or English and think, okay, now, not only how do, how do I present it through my computer and, and projector, but how then, what piece can I put in for them? You definitely need a teacher a technology teacher who is in there who understands the classroom teacher's situation and also understands the technology. I see a very big evolution of the teachers really understanding that the workplace of tomorrow requires more than skills. It requires the ability to work together, the ability to develop team relationships, listen to new information that's constantly happening daily. You know, being an involved parent and someone who's been involved with the Parents Association here at Magnolia, I've had the opportunity to spend a lot of time in the lab and really see how it's used and how, what a benefit it is for the teachers. I mean, there, the boards on the wall are filled all the time. The teachers are clamoring before and after school to try and get on the schedule and brainstorming how they can deliver curriculum. And it's exciting for them to be able to see how they get to use it to light their kids up and light them on fire with education. Um, I think it's also the teachers who've been here for a while probably don't recognize even how great that is because they probably think it's, this is a model that's everywhere and it's not and it should be. One of the things that we would love to do is to have the same model that we have very successfully created in the Rattler Pit at each of the elementary schools. I would like to see technology integrated more in the curriculum. It's just not to have a, a computer stuck away in the corner of the classroom gathering dust. I think that they're going to need a lot of support, so somebody who can guide them and help them through lessons that they have planned so that it will be successful for them. And I think having someone in there instructing who has got some familiarity with our curriculum really is a bonus, I would say a necessity. Mm -hmm. The huge catalyst to this project would be the implementation of a partner teacher. That partner teacher salary benefits would be an ongoing expense to the district. Every year, the school district would need to have another position in order to fund that. The funding does, is not calculated that way. Funding in California schools is funded on the students in each teacher's roster by class. Unfortunately, a technology teacher must come from another source of funding. I've lived this for the last seven years, and I've seen 500 students a day go through this lab. It gives me goosebumps. We've got the model. Equipment that works, and not just a technology specialist,
but a certified teacher who collaborates to help teachers think differently about the way they teach. To implement this model requires an investment. It will take the collaboration of the community, the government, and business to fund this model of teaching with technology. We need your help to make this a reality at other schools.